Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. What a wonderful So today's video is going to be my SAS haul. I have two bags down here of the two stores that I went to and I'm so excited to show you guys my finds. Okay, let's start with some candles. I actually did find a 75% off candle, so let's start with that. So this Christmas candle was $6.37 and I picked up peppermint sugar cookie from last year in the beautiful little like sugar plum fairy line. So cute, little nutcracker kind of scene. One of my favorite scents for winter time. The notes are crushed peppermint, vanilla extract, creamy butter, and soft sugar cookies. I knew that I wanted this one um, because I didn't have an extra one that I saved from last year. So this will be mine for 2023 Christmas time, but I actually did not see a ton of Christmas candles. My store only had like maybe three different scents. Um, and this was one of them that they had the most of, but um, there was barely any Christmas and no fall whatsoever. So that was a little disappointing, but maybe we'll see it later on in the sale. And then for the 1095 candles, first I picked up Santorini Coast and I did have this one earlier in the year and I completely burned through it and I loved it. So I had to pick up a backup. It smells like this wonderful coconut kind of sunscreen scent, but in my opinion, I still like it. It's creamy coconut, almond blossom and warm vanilla. Just like a really sophisticated coconut vanilla scent. It smells so good. And then I picked up blueberry marshmallow bar. So I know everybody was going crazy about this one during um, the candle day in December of 2023. And then also just in SAS time as well. But it came out, I believe for real in January and I never really got it. I wasn't interested in it, but for 10.95, I'll pick it up. And I do love blueberry scents for summertime. So the notes are sugar blueberries, sweet vanilla and toasted marshmallows. So this one I'm also excited about because my boyfriend is obsessed with blueberry scents. And to me, this one kind of smells similar to uh, blueberry pie. So that was one of my favorites. So I'm really happy to have this one. But yeah, I don't get really any like crust or anything for blueberry pie, but I definitely get blueberries and maybe a little bit of marshmallow that might come out more when I burn it. And the last 1095 candle I got is Feel Loved Champagne Cupcake from this year's Valentine's Day collection with this beautiful heart lid, which I will definitely save even after I'm finished with this candle. But it smells really nice and yummy. It's very like super sugary. The notes are fluffy cake, whipped vanilla frosting and pink sprinkles. So I definitely think it smells like champagne toast mixed with some sort of cakey note. So I'm liking it. I love it. Um, I might not use it right now. I might save it for next spring but it's so pretty, I could not pass picking this up. And the regular price is $32.95, so this was a really good deal. Next, let's get into some body care. I did pick up Whipped Coconut Milkshake. This one was on my list, and I, probably the one I was most excited about for the SAS releases. So the notes on this are vanilla ice cream, toasted coconut, and sugared amber. It really just smells like vanilla coconut. Nothing crazy special, and this might actually be a repackage of vanilla coconut. It really just smells like super simple, vanilla coconut but it smells good so i'm excited to have this one i don't have like a coconut body lotion for the summer so very excited to have this one and it was only 50 percent off so it was around like 850. and then on the 75 percent off table i found this men's shower gel in after dark so the notes on this are spiced bergamot amber and smooth tonka this one i got for my boyfriend he's running low on his shower gels mostly because i just stock him up at sas or uh in the winter time for Christmas. So this one smells really good, very manly, super strong, and it was 75% off. So that made it $3.62. Really good deal for this one. Originally $14.50. And the last body care item I got at store number one is in the stars, and this was not on sale, but I did have a free item coupon. So I just picked it up because I was needing some sort of like perfumey lotion for a set that I'm building. So picked up this one. And then I did pick up three Wallflower fragrance refill bulbs. These were all $4.95. So first I got Coconut Lime Breeze. I figured this would be great for the heat of the summer, like July and August. It's Zesty Lime, Lemon Verbena, and Sheer Coconut. I've actually never tried it, so I'm excited to see how this smells. Picked up Mahogany Teakwood. Of course, you guys know how this one smells. And a Laundry Day. So those two are going to be really good in our bathrooms, and I just 
needed some more new uh, refills. Okay, next we're gonna move on to store number two, which I did not get as much there, but I did get some good stuff. So I will say this store had a lot more single wicks and they were all $5.95. So I did pick up two of the seven ounce single wicks. First is Mahogany Vanilla. I've had this one before and both Ryan and myself, which Ryan's my boyfriend, we absolutely love this one. It's warm vanilla, bergamot and sweet sandalwood. Oh, just like a super simple, sweet, but still refreshing scent. So had to pick this one up on sale. And then I also picked up a cozy linen. You know, I never really had any interest in this little line when it came out, but um, this one smells like Gain fabric sheets. It smells so good. So the notes are Lily of the Valley petals, sweet orange and cotton musks. Yeah, it just smells like laundry detergent. <laughs> So happy to have this one. This will be like a really nice one for like cleaning days and maybe even just to put like in the bathroom or in the bedroom and burn. I feel like it'd be really nice. Okay, next I have some body care from the 75% off table and this was mostly stuff from other seasons and actually from past SASs. So this is pink chiffon right here in the body cream that I picked up and on the spine here, it does, the number starts with a two. So this is from 2022, that's how you can tell the um, age of stuff. But the notes are sparkling red pear, jasmine petals, tiari flower, vanilla orchid, and chiffon musk. I've actually never tried pink chiffon, so I'm excited to see how it smells. But I know for a fact, Tina Marie says this one is amazing and definitely a pickup if you like, like kind of berry sugary scents. So that's exactly what it smells like like a sugary berry scent. And I also need this one to um, build up a body care combo that I'm thinking of. So picked up pink chiffon and this one was $4 and 12 cents. And then I picked up something pretty exciting into the night in the moisturizing body wash. Now I don't think this is the old um, packaging. This is from 2022 as well on the spine, it says two. So this is still pretty new. I don't really know why um, Into the Night was in the 75% off section, but it was only in there in the moisturizing body wash formula, not anything else. So I thought a deal is a deal. So I picked it up. The notes are Raspberry Noir, Amber Crystals, Velvety Rose Petals, Creamy Patchouli, and Mocha Musk. And this one was $3.37, which I think is a great deal for a moisturizing body wash, which is originally $13.50. And this one, I've actually never had a full size of Into the Night, but I've had minis and I really like it. And I have it in the perfume. So I figured I'd pick this one up just to like have on hand and to have for like date nights and stuff when I'm feeling really special. And the last 75% off body care item I picked up is Twilight Woods in the body lotion. This was a pretty good find in my opinion. I think it's an online exclusive right now. And I know it was out, I think a few SASs ago. So this is actually from 2021 and you can read on the bottom of lotions, this little like printed um, code down here at the bottom underneath the price tag, not on the price tag, starts with a one for me. So that means it's from 2021, but Twilight Woods doesn't even have a like list of notes. It actually has like a paragraph that says what it smells like, which is because it's an old, it's actually a retired fragrance that came back. I believe it's from like the 2000s or maybe the 2010s. I remember seeing it out when I was younger, but I never picked it up. So the fragrance sentence goes, this hypnotic scent is an intoxicating blend of lush berry, sparkling mandarin and soft mimosa with a lasting impression of apricot nectar and cypress wood. It smells amazing. It kind of reminds me of high school or middle school. And I'm really excited to um, use this one in the fall because it definitely it gives off that like berry scent, but like berry with musk. So it's definitely like a fall perfect scent. So I'm excited to have this one. Really happy that I picked it up and it was only $3.12. And then on the 50% off table, I did pick up Gingham Vibrant in the body scrub. This one, the associate told me that this one's actually going out of stock. They're not gonna keep this one. They're gonna keep the other ginghams, but not Gingham Vibrant. So the notes on this are wild blackberries, candied violets, and soft vanilla. I actually had not smelled this one. I just like picked it up on a whim because I needed some sort of gentle scrub. And this is a foaming sugar body scrub. So it's more gentle than like the sand scrubs, which the sand scrubs were on sale for $3.95, but I really don't like that formula. This is so strong. I would definitely say the violet is the strongest part of this, 
but I do still like it because it has that like blackberry in there that makes it kind of fruity. So I'm hoping that I'm still gonna like this one in the shower, even though it's pretty heavy on the violet and I don't like florals, but that's Gingham Vibrant. It was 50% off. So originally it's $19.95 and I got it for $9.97. So I think that's pretty good for a very new scent in the body scrub. And then my goal for SAS was actually to buy more mini body care than anything else, but honestly, my stores had barely any minis. I asked an associate at the second store if any of them were on sale, and she said that two sides of one of the rotating carts was three for seven. So I picked up three minis um, for $7. So first I have white coconut and caramel. This is from last fall, and I had it last fall, and it was really nice. I loved this scent. It smells like um, coconut cream pie to me. It smells really good. So I picked this one up. So they were all like $2.30 each. I picked up another Midnight Amber Glow Mini Fine Fragrance Mist, which I have one of these, but I picked up another one because it's one of my favorites. And then I picked up After Dark in the mini shower gel for Ryan, just so he can use it on any upcoming trips. So that's my little three minis. Okay, so that is it for my first semi-annual sale haul of June 2023. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I did get quite a few things and some things that weren't on my list. I kind of deviated from my wish list, but I still have some things that I want to get, namely hand soaps and more minis and hand creams. So I will be shopping again probably next week, checking back every week just to see what the changes are in the pricing structure. But that's everything for today's video. Let me know down below if you have shopped yet. What did you find? Did you find anything really awesome? Find anything you know that you've been looking for? Let me know down below and we can have a little conversation down in the comments. But that is everything for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.